close. This content was published on November 28, 2017, 403 p.m. NOV 28-2017-1603 Workers empty the convoys of humanitarian aid in Doma, inside eastern al Gouda on the outskirts of the Syrian capital, Damascus, on August 17, 2017 Keystone The Swiss Rin International Committee of the Red Cross ICRC says it needs over 2 billion Swiss francs $2 billion to help millions of people affected by conflict and violence in countries like Syria, Sudan and Yemen next year. The appeal to institutional donors reflects an 11.6% increase on the ICRC's external link 2017 field budget. The ICRC is deeply concerned by the number and scale of protracted conflicts the world is facing today, ICRC President Peter Maurer told donors in Geneva on Tuesday, both their immediate and longer-term consequences on the millions of people affected should alarm us all. While some of these conflicts are often in the news, many are overlooked, out of the public spotlight. We are appealing for donors' support to make sure these people are not forgotten. The ICRC, which is on the ground in over 80 countries, provides humanitarian assistance to victims of conflict and violence worldwide. It employs around 16,000 people, including 1,000 at its Geneva headquarters, Swiss Info, CHSB form for signing up for free newsletter. Sign up for our free newsletters and get the top stories delivered to your inbox. The following content is sourced from external partners. We cannot guarantee that it is suitable for the visually or hearing impaired. Join us on Facebook all rights reserved. The content of the website by Swissinfo.ch is copyrighted. It is intended for private use only. Any other use of the website content beyond the use stipulated above, particularly the distribution, modification, transmission, storage and copying requires prior written consent of Swissinfo.ch. Should you be interested in any such use of the website content, please contact us via contact at swissinfo.ch. As regards the use for private purposes, it is only permitted to use a hyperlink to specific content, and to place it on your own website, or a website of third parties. The swissinfo.ch website content may only be embedded in an ad-free environment without any modifications. Specifically applying to all software, folders, data and their content provided for download by the Swissinfo.ch website, a basic non-exclusive and non-transferable license is granted that is restricted to the one-time downloading and saving of said data on private devices. All other rights remain the property of Swissinfo.ch. In particular, any sale or commercial use of these data is prohibited. Reuse article ICRC seeks 2 billion Swiss francs for 2018 humanitarian work November 28, 2017 1603 The Swiss Ren International Committee of the Red Cross ICRC says it needs over 2 billion Swiss francs $2 billion to help millions of people affected by conflict and violence in countries like Syria, Sudan and Yemen next year. The appeal to institutional donors reflects an 11.6% increase on the ICRC's 2017 field budget. The ICRC is deeply concerned by the number and scale of protracted conflicts the world is facing today, ICRC President Peter Maurer told donors in Geneva on Tuesday, both their immediate and longer-term consequences on the millions of people affected should alarm us all. While some of these conflicts are often in the news, many are overlooked, out of the public spotlight. We are appealing for donors' support to make sure these people are not forgotten. The ICRC, which is on the ground in over 80 countries, provides humanitarian assistance to victims of conflict and violence worldwide. It employs around 16,000 people, including 1,000 at its Geneva headquarters, Times Dubai Reuters The Sadiled Military Coalition Fighting Heavy Rebels in Yemen said on Wednesday. It would allow humanitarian aid access. The head of the Geneva-based International Committee of the Red Cross ICRC is hoping that an upcoming international conference on migration. Following the recent abduction of a Swiss aid worker in Sudan, we ask whether it is safe for individuals to work in crisis countries. By Josh Smith Cobble Reuters The International Committee of the Red Cross will drastically cut back its operations in Afghanistan following. By Frederick Byrne and Geneva Neutrality is the Red Cross word. But with a greater push for closer business ties, how will that policy play out by Simon Bradley? Deliberate attacks on health facilities, aid workers and patients in war zones must be condemned more strongly, warn humanitarian officials. By Swissinfo.ch and agencies Although Syria seems to be going through a relatively peaceful period, the humanitarian situation remains daunting, according to Peter Maurer, 